Finally, the NFL is back, and we're kicking off the season with the Cowboys facing off against the Buccaneers to open it up. We're down in Tampa Bay to see some Thursday night football. It's going to be exciting. We're going to see Tom Brady versus Dak Prescott. Ezekiel Elliott's going to be running all over the place. While we got Antonio Brown, Mike Evans, and Chris Godwin catching every single pass Tom Brady can throw at them. But what's this game going to come down to? Let's take a look at some of the key points that I think are going to make the difference for both teams. For the Buccaneers, it starts off with their quarterback, Tom Brady. Tom Brady is getting a little long in the tooth. Well, actually, not more than a little. But Tom Brady has been dominant every single season. He has played in where he has remained healthy. Is he going to be able to continue his remarkable run as the greatest quarterback of all time? He does face off against a, a mild defense. Cowboys have a good front seven, but their back end is pretty weak. Their defensive backfield. I don't know if they can hold up against the receiving core, the talent that the Tampa Bay Buccaneers have. That's really going to be a key for them. Can the Cowboys get pressure and can the defensive backfield hold off just for that extra split second? Just make Tom Brady second guess himself and maybe steal a victory tonight. But let's keep looking at the Buccaneers. Buccaneers also got Leonard Fournette back. He was a revelation for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers later on in the season last year. He really came into his own, really started rushing the ball hard, running with power, running like the number four overall pick he was with the Jacksonville Jaguars. Is he going to be able to sustain that? This may not be the game to prove that because the Dallas Cowboys do have a good front seven. It's going to be pretty hard to run the ball against them. But hey, you never know. I've seen crazier things in my lifetime. Like the Chiefs losing 31-9 in the Super Bowl. But that was last year. We're moving on. Now we're going to the defense of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Stout. It's going to be a top defense in the NFL. Top, th top three is my guess. Top five is guaranteed. Because they, they just have so much talent defensively. It's going to be very hard to see them falling out of that top five. Unless they just get marred by injuries. Which I don't see happening. And... To add to that, they face off some pretty lackluster offenses within their own division with the Carolina Panthers as well as the Atlanta Falcons after the loss of Julio Jones. Dak Prescott, though. Dak Prescott's that boy. He's he's good. He's that guy, man. He, he can be a franchise quarterback for any team in the league. He is better. He was better last year than 90% of the quarterbacks in the league. There's only a couple guys, maybe Rodgers, Mahomes, and Brady, who I would have said last year were are better than Dak Prescott when he was healthy. But that's the key. How, how right is he? How back is he? It was a severe injury. A lot of people thought it was career-threatening for Dak Prescott. But he has come back. He will start week one. He has Amari Cooper, Michael Gallup, C.D. Lamb. Cowboys are stacked on the offensive side of the ball. Their offensive line may not be what it used to be, considering... The injuries that have occurred to some of their star players, like a Tyron Smith, like a Zach Martin, the loss of Travis, Travis Frederick to injury. But they're still a great offensive line, still a top offensive line. That offense is going to be special. The biggest question marks for the Cowboys this season comes on the defensive side of the ball. And it just seems like every single time the Cowboys shoot themselves in the foot. Will that change this season? I'm not sure because you never know. You never know with football. That's why football is so great. Any given Sunday, or in this case, Thursday. But can the Cowboys ride that offense home? This, this could be a shootout. I don't expect that to happen. My projection for the score is probably going to be like a 31-17 game, 24-10 type of game. Two touchdowns, respectable. But uh, can the Cowboys defense... Hold the line against the Buccaneers. This is going to be one of their tougher tests of the season. The big questions come against the Washington football team, the Giants, the Eagles. You know, those big rivalry games we always see the Cowboys in. That they just somehow split the series every time. If they can win those games, they're playoff bound. It's a weak division. But let's see how the Cowboys can fare against the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. This is going to be a good benchmark for them. I still believe the Buccaneers are going to win pretty convincingly like i said two touchdowns but hey i'm just excited football's back let's see how it goes welcome to week one 